Hello everyone, my name is Gar the Pirate, and I am trying out a Let's Play for the very first time. Um, and so if you like this video, please let me know, and be sure to tell me if you hate it, uh, or anything like that, and I will do my best to continue doing what I'm doing, because this is really going to be for, um, kind of, kind of a historical effort now. I'm just more curious of what it's like to do a Let's Play. I've watched lots of Let's Plays, and I've been inspired by a lot of people, um, and for, for instance, uh, probably, um, uh, Paul Ceres Jr. Uh, was the first one that I started watching, and then Ethos was the second one. And really, out of those two, I really just I I, I I received a lot of inspiration from them. And I've been playing Minecraft for a long time, uh, back since um, the beta. Um, and I just I really want to give it uh, my own shot, just. Because uh, I've never tried. This is also going to be my first YouTube video. So if you like it, please let me know. Um, feel free to sus subscribe. Um, that will definitely encourage me to continue making them. I like automation. Um, I also like mods. Um, so don't be surprised when you see things that are out of the ordinary. And if you have questions about the mods I've installed, uh, I'll probably cover them over time, especially uh, uh, as I'm gathering materials and just starting to put things together. Uh, as I come across mods uh, that are significant, I will definitely mention them. And if you ask, I will probably also release a uh, mod load that I have. Uh, maybe even make a mod pack so you can follow along if you feel like it. Uh, so, first I'm going to gather some resources and then we will check back. Um, but in the meantime, I'm going to do some world exploration because I have installed as one of my mods uh, Biomes of Plenty. Which, if you haven't ever tried it, you should. Uh, it also has the option for um, amplified biomes along with its typical generation. And so that's what I did. I, uh, I amplified it by two times, and that's what I started generating. So, um, we'll s oh, look, we got pumpkins already. This never happens to me. I, I mean, it really, it really never happens to me. I know you both of you are, I mean, you might be kind of annoyed by the fact that I'm using a book to, uh, to harvest with, but uh, there's a reason for that, and I will show you why in just a second here. Um, gosh, I love these biomes. Um, this is going to be a fun experience, so... Uh, Feel free to stick with me. Oh, wait, I'm not doing it right. Punch down a tree. Oh, man. Punch the trees down. So first off, the first mod I will formally introduce to you is this one right here. So as you see, I just punched this entire tree down, and as you stand back and mag just just revel in its glory of floating leafness, you'll notice that it's just floating there. Can't tell you how much that bugs me. Um, that's that's just so unimmersive. When I chop down a tree in real life, because I do that all the time, the tree falls. All of it, not just part of it. So, what I'm going to do is I am going to chop the tree down 
and it will fall as expected. Ta-da! That is called Tree Chopper. If you've never used it before, you're welcome. Go download it. It is awesome. Oh, gosh. It's nighttime already. Oh, freak. And crap. Oh, damn. I need to survive the night. That's always priority number one. We've got enough wood for the night, so... to put these down, my tool station, sensor table, and part builder. I also need a crafting station. The, the crafting station is really helpful, it links up to everything. So, part building, tool station. Um, I'm going to put tool station in the middle because I feel like I use that the most. Second, um, see, crafting tool, art stencil. It's amazing. So what we'll do is we'll get ourselves a little chest to get by for now. And now, as you can see, my chest shows up in the inventory too. So it's just a dandy way to get by. I now need some basic stuff like binding. Axe head, axe head. Can make life easier. Let's make parts now. I'm going straight to stone. I don't could care less about all these other craps. Oh no. no I just took them out, but. And we have our first Tinker's tool in this world. If you don't know how to do that, you go to your tool station, you craft the necessary parts, and if you don't know what the necessary parts are, you'll be able to see that within the sub-item of one that you want to build. Like the axe, for instance. Like the hatchet, we go to it, it says these are the things you'll need. Take the items that you make, and the part builder, drop them in here, and you have yourself a hatcher that you can name for free. Sounds a little tough. Let's see if we can't get a kill. Oh well. There we go. This is a, a loot bag. Added with loot bags mod, as you see in the blue down there. If you have any questions over about any mods that I have, you 
usually using Wayla. I can see uh, what mod is the item comes from. Oh goody, we got a track. Alright, so not a whole heck of a lot going on there. So where do I want my farm? Hmm. I usually keep things way too close. I'd like to spread things out a bit. It'll make the game a little harder at the beginning, but it'll make it more interesting. So I'm thinking... If we're up there and we can look out, I would like to see my farm, so maybe we'll use this plot of land for the farm. I like it. So I'm going to go to cutting this down. Uh, you know, actually, I'm very low on food. So we will start by planting some of the cash crops. Oh, there's no way. It broke. It actually broke. That was like 10 pieces of dirt. And then it broke. Yes, I'm a hoarder. I will dive in the water for that. For that, those seeds. Okay. That was another mod that I added. Increases the range of the tools based on the tier of tool. Okay. I may have to eat you, chicken. Things are not looking good. I'm going to make another tool station. That way I can repair this shovel on the go as it seems. It will require a lot of repairing. Sixteen turbine ability, come on. That's just ridiculous. Uh, it is legitimately the worst thing I've ever seen. Why would I even make a wooden shovel? I know what it is. But I bet if I make this out of stone, make this out of stone. Durability, one modifier. Oh, yep. That's what it is. Stone handle is much, much better. Ha, 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 ha! 